Hello and welcome to Monday. I want to start off by saying it's a really nice feeling when you don't do vlogs at like 3 or 4 in the morning. Because it's not 3 or 4 in the morning. Yesterday um, we had stayed up, we got Dragon Ball done, and I was talking a little bit about you know recording the entirety of the project and um, how that helps me. I don't know if I specifically mentioned why, but some of you may be able to figure it out. When we can record ahead and get an entire project done, that's all stuff that we don't have to worry about. I can get those episodes edited, maybe even uploaded, scheduled ahead of time. I can turn my attention back towards doing vlogs or one of the many other things that needs done. So doing that's fantastic. So that's one of the reasons we decided to pair Dragon Ball with Journey. And we just finished playing Journey. Journey is incredible. I mean, I, I don't even know how better to describe it, but it was like... It was very good. It was really good. It was also, it was actually shorter than I thought it would, thought it would be because I checked how long to beat and how long to beat said it was, it was, a bit longer than well, it said it was two to three hours, and I think we finished the game in like an hour and 45, so it was actually a little shorter than I thought it would be, but it was still good. I think it's in total going to be like six episodes, so it's, it's not particularly long, but it's, it's amazing. It's, it's beautiful. It's, it's a perfect example of games as art. And it's actually created by the company that did a bunch of other artsy games like Flower and Flow. Um, and Journey just fits into that puzzle perfectly. So for all of the people that told us for years to play Journey, you have your wish. And also, thank you for staying on our case about playing it because it was, it was absolutely incredible. It's so beautiful. And um, I said that in the recording, but one of the things you start thinking about immediately is... Um, Man, I gotta get so and so to play this. You know, so and so's gotta play this. Who's gotta play this? Jarrett. The first, the first thing that comes to mind is Jarrett because um, it's a similar experience. And once again, I talk about this in the LP. So if this is coming out after, I apologize for the continuation. But um, it reminds me a bit of Portal in the sense that Portal is a very small story, but it's it's so well done, and you leave thinking that it was you know the perfect size. It did what it needed to do, and then it was finished, and it was just, it was a really great game. Journey does the same thing. And Jarrett actually played Portal for the first time when he visited me in college. So what'd you think? Awesome. Good. Portal was awesome. Absolutely awesome. So this is the same type of thing. You know, if he comes over, I'm like, take 90 minutes and play this, because it's just really, really good. <laughs> um, and it is. It's just, it's a really fun and uh, unique experience, and I enjoyed it a lot. Me too. Anyway, so that was good. Uh, Journey is a fun game, you guys should play it. But also, I was making chili for dinner. When is it gonna be ready? I mean, it's practically ready. Oh. Good, that's exciting. You also notice that the big package over there, the iMac. The IMAX here. So, honestly, things have been a little rough around here lately with um, a lot of the stuff that we've had to do. But, between recording the entirety of Dragon Ball yesterday and the entirety of Journey today and getting, you know, just a bunch of extra content done, and then the iMac arriving, haven't tested it yet, fingers crossed this one's not broken. Um, you know, between all this stuff, things are looking up, and I feel good. Like, and that's just a human thing. Whenever things start going good in your life, then you, you feel better. And um, I was just really busy around the holidays, and uh, I'm, I'm glad that things are calming down, and I'm starting to get caught up on some stuff. Uh, oh, and one other thing I, I want to talk about. Um, I'm actually using the Elgato game capture software on Windows, just because uh, I looked at the the Windows software page for it, and it's just, they're a lot further along on Windows than Mac. And I've had some problems with the Mac version, unfortunately. I wish I wish I didn't, but I do. There's a few times where it's like if you record past a certain point, it starts the recording over. Like, it's hard to explain. Like, if you record two hours, let's say you record three hours. At the two hour mark, it just starts over. And it's not exactly two hours, and sometimes it doesn't happen, but it does happen occasionally which means that you end up losing parts of recordings. That's bad. Um, and I have a feeling that that just wouldn't happen on uh, Windows. 
so we're going to do it on Windows. Um, I think when it comes down to it, the Elgato hardware and software are just, they're, they're probably tested a lot more on Windows. Obviously, they're uh, an entire version ahead on Windows, and um, maybe it would just be better to run it on Windows. So that's what I did, and we captured it, and everything seems fine. So probably do more captures on Windows because of that. Now, when I was using um, Blackmagic, they're super hardcore Mac OS X. Everything is tested for Mac, primarily because that's their that's their main user base, or is Mac users. And uh, I gotta say, when I was using the Blackmagic card on my Hackintosh for the many, many years, up until the point it you know, finally died a few months ago, um, I never had a single problem. Not one. Zero. Ever. It just always worked perfect, um, which is great. And I've ha I have had some problems with the Elgato, and I don't know if I'm going to run into those same issues on the Windows side or not, but it just seemed safer, so now I'm going to run the, the software on Windows for the foreseeable future, in case it gives me any trouble on Mac. All right. I've rambled on long enough. I want to eat some. Yes. 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 Yes! You haven't tried it yet, how do you yes know? Yesing intensifies! Yes! I'm really excited about this. Okay. Chili is one of my favorite things to eat, one of my favorite things for Mal to make. Ha! Ah, Mal makes. Um, Maybe I'll make it on Mal makes someday. You just put chili on a canvas? <laughs> yes. It's an idea. Um, one of my favorite things for her to make, but also it's been chili. I can't say the temperature, because everyone that lives north of here will be like, that's not cold, Steven. To be fair, it's been like up, down, up, down. Like the other day it was in the 60s, and then yeah. it was like in the teens, and that's like two days difference. Yeah, so it's a bit much. So we're going to have this, watch an episode of Dragon Ball Z, and uh, get to bed. It's, it's late. Um, <laughs> I'm going to end this vlog by saying that we set up that computer, and then I'm going to end the vlog by saying... We can't throw away the box. And you're like, wait, no. We'll talk about it tomorrow. I just can't believe that this is happening. Thanks for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?